Alright guys, it's um, 4.24 in the morning. Woke up a little late today. I was supposed to be waking up at 4. But um, I don't have much to do. I already have everything packed and ready for food. So I'm about to start my morning cardio. My first session. Let's see how this goes. I'm already, I'm pretty tired. But <laughs> gotta get it done. Alright guys, I just got done with morning cardio. Did 15 minutes today. I'm starting off slow. Um, <clears throat> it went good. Um, worked up a little bit of a sweat. It's really cold outside, actually. I didn't wear a jacket or anything. I just wore a t-shirt and shorts. And, uh, yeah, so I'm about to cook breakfast and, uh, get ready for the day. Start working about an hour. So, let's get this done. I got my sausages on there. So I put a little bit of cinnamon and a little bit of garlic in my eggs. One a bit of sriracha on my eggs. It's like ketchup without all the extra calories. Oh yeah. All right, got my vitamins here, my fish oil, vitamin C, multivitamin mineral, vitamin D, all the essentials. Pop these back real quick. Mm-hmm, and drink them. Ah, okay, those are down. Let me put my, uh, all you day you may. So I can have some BCAs while, I, while I'm working. And uh, makes the water go down easier, tastes better. And let me go get ready and dressed for work. We here, baby. Let's get it in. What's going on, YouTube? It's your boy coming at you with that first ever commentary to start off the vlog, The Journey. So this is week one. Let's get right into it. Um, have a chest and try workout for you guys today. Um, I start off some inner and outer rotations with the wrist resist, uh, resistance band. Um, this helps uh, warm up the the joints, the tendons, the muscles all around the rotator cuff, the whole shoulder area. Make sure you're uh, nice and lubed up and ready for the workout. I cannot emphasize how important this is before you do any upper body uh, workout. You know your shoulders are probably the most prone for injury, so doing this, stretching that whole area out, getting blood in there is very important. So I did three sets of 20 reps there. After that, I did three sets of face pulls and extended my arms up at the very top. Three sets of 20 reps as well. After that, I did two warm-up sets of push-ups, which was on my knees because I'm so heavy. Got to make sure there's blood in the chest and everything's ready to go before I start my actual, you know, real sets. Um, and then this is my uh, my push-up routine. I did 10 sets of push-ups total. Uh, three of the push-ups were standard, as you see here. I am using dumbbells and a plates to get a deeper stretch on the bottom. Um, and uh, after each set of push-ups, I superseted it with... Uh, Dumbbell uh, lateral raises. I uh, used a 50 pound dumbbell, uh, did uh, 15 reps every time, I believe, and uh, that was one heck of a burn, I'll tell you right now. <laughs> one heck of a burn in the delts. Um, after that, I did uh, four sets of decline push ups. My, knee, my legs are not fully extended out because I'm just trying to implement this in the push up routine, so I'm trying to make sure my, my shoulders and my, my upper body can handle that. I don't want to snap anything, so by next week, I'll probably have my legs fully extended out. Um, after those four sets, I did three sets of declined um, closed grip push-ups to emphasize more on the triceps. And I was hitting anywhere from 25 to 35 reps. My first set, I hit, I think, 48 reps. But after that, I was starting to fatigue <laughs> pretty fast. Um, after that, I hit uh, dumbbell incline uh, flies. And I did five sets of uh, 14 reps. I was doing 50-pound dumbbells there. Good stretch in the chest. And then after that, I did dumbbell pullovers with a 70-pound dumbbell. Uh, five sets of uh, 16 reps, I believe. Um, after that, I did tricep. Uh, I did some uh, dips on the assisted machine because I can't do my current body weight yet. So it took 120 pounds off my body, so I was doing about 248. And then uh, five sets of uh, 14 reps, I believe. Then I did some tricep extensions with a 20-pound dumbbell. Um, the heaviest I went was 25 pounds, and then I did about five sets of around 15 to 20 reps. Shout out to Marcus for recording for me. Thanks, brother. Appreciate it. Um, you can see my face right there. I'm actually in a lot of pain. I'm suffering from I'm suffering from some bad tendonitis in my elbows right now. So I've been icing it and trying to recover from that. Um, after that, I did some uh, skull crushers, keeping the skull crushers behind my head to keep the stress off the elbows and get a better stretch on the tri tricep. After that, I did some tricep pushdowns. Um, all those were five sets of around 14 to 16 reps. Alright guys, it's, uh, it's Wednesday the 8th. About to do my second fasted cardio session. Let's get it. <laughs> hey guys, we are on our way to the gym. 
About to go train legs. I love training legs. Unfortunately, my training partner bailed on me again because he's lazy and he's gonna see this video and he's gonna know, he's gonna know I'm talking about him. <laughs> he's, uh, he's bailed on me too many times for me to count this last month, so yeah. So I'm gonna train solo again. So I'll see you guys in a bit. All right, guys, it is leg day. Um, let's get right into it. Uh, did a couple warm-up sets with my body weight first, sat in the hole in the squat position, and uh, moved around for about 15 seconds, did a couple sets of that, just to get that blood in there, try to stretch everything out, get used to going uh, to that depth, and then did some uh, minor stretching for the hamstrings, the quads, the calves, and then started doing some warm-up sets. I did one plate, did two sets of that, and did about 15 reps. 10-15 uh, reps from around there and then went into the working sets which was uh, my first set was two plates did that for about 15 reps went to three plates and did that for five sets and that was about six to ten reps roughly somewhere on there wasn't trying to push myself too hard because I'm still trying to get myself familiar with the movement and uh, get used to doing squats again if you haven't done it in a while it's like you're relearning the movement again um, leg presses did uh, seven sets total started off with eight plates went to ten plates went to twelve plates did three sets of 12 plates, then went back, back down to 10 plates, uh, and then back down to 8 plates. And did as many reps as I can. I was hitting somewhere between 18 to 24 reps. Um, went into some walking lunges here, did three sets of that, um, 20 reps um, each set. Then did some uh, hamstring curls. Um, did three sets, the whole stack, um, about 18 to 20 reps. Quad extensions, the same thing. The whole stack, three sets of around 18 to 20 reps. Um... I forget the name of these workouts, to be honest. I don't remember the exact name. But what it does is it trains the inner and outer thighs. And uh, I did um, th uh, five sets. I superseded one after the other. And I did around 20 reps, 25 reps, with the whole stack. Uh, it was a good little burn on, on the thighs. Then did some calf raises. Same scheme as the leg press. Um, started off with three plates. Went to four plates, five plates, six plates. Did three sets with six plates and pyramided all the way back down to three plates. And uh, that's my leg workout. All right, guys. Um, just got back from uh, my dad's birthday uh, dinner that we had. We went to Claim Jumpers. Had some good food. I mean, I had like uh, some salmon and uh, crab and a little bit of rice and some vegetables. I didn't eat as much as I wish I could have. And they and they made it hard, man. They got the calamari. They got the the fried bread uh, cheese sticks. The they got all kinds of stuff, ribs, steak, um, mother load cake, I mean, some bomb food, uh, carrot cake. So I really had to wrestle with myself not to eat. And I didn't eat anything, I didn't even pick. But then when I got home, I had my last meal, which was cottage cheese, and I saw those two go to containers. I opened it up and I smelt that food and I was like, oh my God. <laughs> I wanted to eat it so bad, but I didn't do it. I fought with, I, I fought with myself for a little bit, but I ended up not doing it, so I'm, I'm glad I did it because I knew I would have regretted it afterwards. But uh, yeah, first time, uh, first big, uh, big um, negotiation with myself, trying not to eat some bad food. So, anyways, guys, I'm gonna let you guys go. I'm gonna go to bed. I'm tired. Tomorrow's my Saturday. I'm gonna wake up. Uh, I'm not gonna wake up super early just because it's my one of my days off. I'm sleeping, and then I'll do fasted cardio, have breakfast, and. So I'm going to be back in buys tomorrow, so I'm excited. I'll see you guys later. Peace. Hey, what's up, guys? I uh, just got done with my third cardio session for the week. It's uh, Friday. It's 1120 right now. Um, I woke up late today. got to sleep in. It's my day off. Um, breakfast is a little different today, guys. I ran out of eggs, and I totally forgot about it. Kind of pissed me off. Uh, <laughs> I still got my uh, multo meal here. And I, my breakfast right now is the same, the Polish dogs. Instead, um, I sauteed also some uh, um, yellow zucchini. I got one ounce of Swiss cheese, and I got two and a half ounces of mortadella, which is like a Middle Eastern uh, lunch meat. It's made out of chicken, and there's some pistachio in there. And that roughly, that's pretty accurate to what I eat in the morning, as far as macronutrient-wise. I, I decided to have a cup of rice as well, because I was still hungry. And it's already 11 something in the afternoon, so I should have already had like two meals and be working on my third in like 45 minutes. So, yeah, I'm gonna have that rice. I think it'll give me a little bit more energy for the gym, anyways. And um, and then I'll train back and buys. You'll be seeing some clips of that soon. And uh, I'll talk about my workout. And um, yeah, just taking it one day at a time. 
Um, I'm a little behind on my meals, obviously, it's 11 something. I'm not stressing too much. I'm sure I'll eat a lot when I get home and uh, get this day started. I lied. I lied to you guys, and I need to be honest with you. I'm having a cup of uh, a cup of beans now. <laughs> I'm still hungry. <laughs> What's up, bro? Back in bars, you buddy. Um, did some uh, pull-ups for my first workout to start this uh, back in by session. Um, did 120 pound assist. And did five sets of around 10 to 12 reps. I like to start off with that. Gets get some good blood in the back and stretches everything out. Gets it ready for some uh, good movements, heavy movements. I did some lat pull downs here. Five sets of about 10 to 12 reps. Start off with 270. Then the other four sets were uh, the whole stack, which was like I think 310 or something. Then did some straight arm push downs. Um, did five sets around uh, 14 to 16 reps. Um, and then went to some one arm uh, dumbbell rows. Um, did five sets, start off with 115, 110 pound dumbbells, did that for two sets of around 12 to 14 reps, went to the 115 pound dumbbells, did that for two sets of about 10 to 12 reps, and then the last set was 120 pound dumbbell for 10 reps. Uh, so that's my five sets total. Um, after that I went to some inverted rows, um, did five sets of around in between 16 to 18 reps I think I was hitting. Um, um, just to finish off the back workout, then went to some barbell curls. I did quite a few warm ups on before I started hitting, hitting my actual working sets because uh, I got some mobility issues on my wrist, so I got to get a lot of blood in there before I can start uh, curling some uh, um, some weight on the on that bar. Um, I started off with I think 80 pounds for warm ups. Went to 110 pounds for my working set. Did that for two sets for about 14 reps, and went to 125 pounds. Did that for three sets of around 10 to 12 reps. And then uh, went to some uh, incline curls. I'm doing 35 pound dumbbells here for about 10 reps each on each side, uh, five sets total. Um, then did some hammer curls, uh, 60 pound dumbbells, I believe, for uh, about 10 reps. And uh, after that, to finish my biceps, I did some uh, straight arm uh, cable curls to get a good stretch on the bicep. And that's my workout. You don't know who I, what I look like. You're the guy. They know your name, but they don't know what you look like. I'm at my boy's house. We're in the in the garage, aka the man cave. We're uh, playing some video games right here, or he's playing some video games. I'm watching. You know, he's uh, you re he's wrecking. You wrecking, Reggie? Yeah, he's wrecking. <laughs> Apparently, he doesn't want you hear his voice either. <laughs> you can talk, mother. Come on, dude. I don't look at this lighting. Do I look, do I look good? I look extra fat in this lighting. That's great. Got my, my jug of water. When are we going to do something? I've been watching you play videos this whole time. Let's go watch a movie. These people are going to think I'm talking to myself. Asshole. <laughs> They're going to think I'm insane. We're gonna cut the video here, guys. I, I'm I'm really talking to somebody. I swear to God, I just can't film them because we put it on camera. But uh, I'll talk to you guys later. <laughs>